Hey guys, CoolBHO3K from XDA Developers here, and I've managed to overclock my Evo to an astounding 1.267 um, gigahertz. This is about 269 or so uh, megahertz more than the stock Evo 3G, which is about a 30% increase. So um, let's see how it works. Um, Alright, let's get this turned on here. Alright, as you can see, right now I'm at the stock speed. It's about a gigahertz. It's 998 megahertz. This is the stock speed of the Evo. Um, so let's go back and let's benchmark it. Um, in Linpack, as you can see, we get about 7 M flops. Um, it kind of fluctuates here and there, but it's about 7. Um, 6.9, high 6.9s. So um, let's go back into set CPU and let's make that higher. Um, you can adjust the max slider and let's adjust it to what I've overclocked the device to, which is about 1.267 megahertz. So um, as you can see, if we tap refresh a couple of times, the device is going up that high. Um, so yeah, let's benchmark it again and see what happens. As you can see, the device is going much higher in its Limpack benchmark. Um, it's peaking at about 8.8 .8 or so. Um, so yeah, that's that's a sizable about 30% increase. Um, I did have to raise the voltage of the higher speeds, um, but it will overclock to about this much, about 1.2 gigahertz or 1.19 gigahertz without a voltage increase um, but with a voltage increase of just a tad bit it's like 25 millivolts it'll actually go up to 1.267 with stability and yeah um, we can benchmark it here as well um, the long bench at the highest speed took about 780 milliseconds and let's go back to stock Oops, it's a bit too far. If we go back to stock, we do another long bench. Took a lot longer. Instead of 780 milliseconds, it took about 985. So, um, as you can see, it's it's pretty stable. I mean, I haven't had any crashes at this speed, and I've been um, using this phone for a bit. Um, it's a fairly stock phone right now because I just got this Evo, um, but yeah, I've been I've been using it. Um, so I'll I'll be releasing the source to this kernel. It's a fairly easy tweak from my previous overclock patches. Um, it's just you know a 25 millivolt increase. Um, so yeah, uh, enjoy guys, and I hope you know devs will be able to come up with other stuff. And I'll, I'll keep working on, you know, set CPU as well as actually trying to get this to overclock even higher. That'll be actually a bit harder than it sounds because you have to actually tweak other things inside the kernel. But I'll try. Um, so, yeah. See you guys later.